time. You guys, this movie, so, so, so many words, like it, it, it's manly, but it's emotional. It's an adventure. It's like, um, I was telling someone that it's like Guns of Navarone meets like Treasure of the Sierra Madre. Oh, amazing. Um, and you nice guys comps. function as such a, such a unit in this movie. Um, how well did you and the rest of the cast know each other before you started uh, production? Garrett and I have known each other and been very dear friends for 15 years. And that's how we ended up becoming brothers in the film. Uh, initially, JC hadn't intended for mm -hmm. these two characters to be brothers, but he was looking at us both and feeling like there was too much similarity physically and just our vibes were too similar that uh, he, he felt like it would be distract. He would ask too many questions if they weren't related. So he was trying to figure out which one of us he would hire and which one he wouldn't. And then he had this, eureka moment of realizing he could just change the script and write us as brothers and have us both. So it was required very little for the two of us to create a brotherly bond, but. But it's been a long time on the pairing. And Oscar and I, have, this is our third film together. And so we've known each other for 10 years and been super close pals. So, you know, jump on this and go on this journey um, with them, especially with the story that's so involved with brotherhood and, and camaraderie, you know, it was a perfect fit. So you've worked together a lot. Did you have any um, uh, bonding kind of exercises that you did in, you know, rehearsals or anything? Or was it, or was that itself the bonding exercise? Uh, we uh, took swimming lessons together, uh, wrestled on the beach. Yeah. Um, Charlie and I would wrestle in the gym because he's a big fan of jujitsu. So he was trying to teach me a few things. Uh, we trained together. We did tactical uh, stuff together with the, uh, you know, with the SEALs and, and the military supervisors that were on the film. I mean, so all these things add up. Um, yeah, we spent some time together. Yeah, we had probably, um, in terms of the way films are made generally, you know, it's like there's been this sort of um, trajectory of truncating rehearsal time because, you know, it's just cost money to get everyone together. But on this, we actually had, um, like two and a half weeks, three weeks of time. And, and really they, they stacked that, those days for us, you know? So we were all together doing military training, horse training, like I said, swim lessons, which was kind of unnecessary, but you know, we, uh, we had fun, you know? It's insurance, man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Gotta cover. You mentioned the military training and um, you know, this movie is so intensely physical. Can you talk a little bit about um, the physical intensity of like climbing mountains and um, carrying just, all that equipment. It was a lot in terms of that. That's, uh, you know, a lot of the equipment that we had in the gym was um, pieces to deal with the elevation and stuff like that. Certain treadmills that um, were um, testing your oxygen yeah, like uh, ops, levels and stuff like that. And just everybody's, you know, direct, uh, endurance because there was so much climbing uh, the stuff in the Sierra Nevadas was was treacherous and I think we're shooting at like 13,000 feet um, the stuff in in Bogota was what like 12 13,000 feet hmm. and just the overall you know all the scenes the action crashes um, you know got to be a lot